Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing the Ugly to Beauty Challenge. If you've already seen my random genetics challenge, then you would recognise Tina Flint. What a beautiful embellishment she is. Today guys, we are going to give her some serious plastic surgery in real time, because I've never done that before. So I thought it would be fun to like give this beauty a beautiful makeover. Let's just remove everything from her so I can get a better look. First thing on my gender is this. Oh. She sure looks tons better. Kind of. Okay, let's get those eyes of hers. Make them a bit larger. Also, she doesn't have those green eyes. Oh, don't mind her bright green eyes like that. I want to make her pretty. I want to make her slow. And then lips are like down her face. Yeah. One thing I love doing in The Sims is making The Sims and building as well. Also having huge families that I can't control because it's so difficult to make over everybody in the family. I also want to do it for another current household soon. Um, what I mean by soon is like never yeah, most popular because I posted a picture of my um sim Layla Foreman and she recently gave birth to her first son her first son what was his name Atticus and she's currently pregnant and I know the gender because I can't be bothered to wait and like find out because I'm impatient. A lovely trait I got from my father. Impatientness. Okay, that's, that's just working right now. She is slaying. But if I don't like this commentary, I'm just gonna like look at my voice and just put music over it anyway. I might do that anyway because why not? So she's looking much more better just from like that little edit up. Well, did I just say that? I need help, sorry as help. So we just need to pour, I want to pour like her eyes back a bit further and then pour. Yes. She's got much more better like profile and stuff. So she's looking a bit better. Okay, what sort of teeth has she got? Hopefully she's got nice straight teeth because that'll make my day easier. Because Tina Flint is amazing. Oh, she's got lovely teeth. Let's go and do some like, skin dates. I don't really put like a skin detail on because I like my default skin. Her eyes are honestly need help because I'm not making the eyelashes look good and that's just stressing me out. So I just went quiet then because I'm concentrating. I'm trying to make this seem attractive. Uh, I know that sounds really offensive, but Sims don't have fear things. They're robots, kind of. They're simulated humans. They're called Sims. So they're a simulator of human life. Oh my god, she looks even worse. And if I put some like long lashes on, that helps a bit more. Cause up the fact that she is not my favourite sim. Mm. Hair. Hair always makes things better. Maybe she'd be a rebel. Like, what is wrong with a rebel? Like, like a nice dark coloured hair. Like, this aqua colour. I've recently like made a sim like this coloured hair. But it looks like she's got this coloured hair. It's more like she's got grey hair but her hair's more like these tones, so it's like a greeny colour. Or something like that. And she is so gorgeous. I wanna do like a let's play with her and her friend. I think her name's Ember, Ember Black, and her best friend is Ginger Redstone, so that they'll be a fun household to play with. 
because like, they've got these like complete opposite personalities happening and it's just like just so triggering for me to try and like work out their storyline and stuff all that dark brown eyes just to help that does help the reason I've been just having dark eyes for my sims okay should look a bit better Mm -hmm. Okay, that looks extremely serious. I'll keep it on because it gives a bit more like personality. And a little bit some like. It just gives like. I feel like I like her now. I feel like Tina is looking a bit more Tina. Tina's rebel, so she can have dark makeup on. Completely different to Tina Flynn from the run of the next child. She's a complete different Sam. Okay, it's time to do her bow day. There's not much with it wrong with her body. Like she's got a nice bow day shape. Tina is a f Tina. I don't want her to be like like old lady body. Not saying that it's an old lady, but so you got below that and you're like 16. It doesn't mean you're old. It means you're growing fast. How to not be offensive, children. Just don't speak when you don't take your own advice. I need to learn that because everyone gets offended by me. <laughs> oh, Tina. Tina, Tina, Tina. Oh, Tina, can we be friends? I feel like we have so much, so much in common. I should personally really like the look of this, 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 this. This so works. This so works, a Tina. Yes, Tina. She's gonna wear that with some like, high waisted jeans because Tina is a cool, edgy girl. She don't need no. But to tell her how to love her life, she is too cool for that. I just need some rips in her jeans. Tina don't know where. Oh no, kill me. Tina don't wear those jeans with no holes in them. She wears a jean. A battered, but comfortable. These jeans are so nice, but when, if you play them in game, your sim glitches out, and when they like their arms are like stuck to their sides, but they're so cute. So I'm just gonna use them for now, but I'm, we'll never use them again. Mm, um, I need to get some stippers. Like it's late. It's late, children, and I am still up beyond hours. Like, cause I'm a clever being. Stay up all night and sleep all day. That's actually how I'm like do things in stone age. But um she will not wear heels I don't think. Just, just too good for that. No, they look too comfortable. They look like she's trying too hard. But these are a bit more Argentina wearing. Tina's like an edgy lip happening, I feel like Tina's missing things from her agenda, like a highlighter. She needs some highlight happening, like I think, nope, she don't need that highlighter to highlight her non-existing cheekbones. What about an edgy lip? That's not an edgy lip, it's more like near nude like it's just like about her skin colour with like a ready purpley tinge that works for me and she like gets herself done up it's not really ugly to beauty it's more like ugly to rebel like, I can't tell that it's Tina Flint I feel like who is she who just walked in like can she be my friend she like this, she was just gonna hate everyone in the room. She honestly looks like Mercy Baldwin, the quite a sim I did only a few weeks ago. But the thing that's annoying me right now is that this thing is not sitting on the shoulders correctly. 
she does she's from the 80s, 80s of the shoulder pads. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this. This is a bit more of a real time in depth video. And I'm thinking Tina is looking glam. So guys, please don't forget to comment, write and subscribe. And I will see you all next time. Bye guys.